it's time for hidden gems number two and we're at Romanby Golf and Country Club It looks amazing and incidentally Dan Brown who did so well in the open just yesterday is a member. Cool. First hole just 327 yards off the whites. Right well for better or worse I'm sending it off the first. Never played the course before but we're going to take the attack to it. Very Healy Dan but it's straight. Well, it's left of where I was aiming, but it looks absolutely fine. It's in a clear area, so let's go. I'd also need a checklist, so I want three birdies. That should stand me in some very good stead. No three putts. want the putting to be on form. That would be great. And no double bogeys. That should turn out quite nicely for me. So let me know what you think in the comments. Have I got it in the locker? Well, no complaints about the tee shot. Just run off the fairway. So hopefully just a chip and a putt. No idea if the greens are receptive or not. Stop. A mm, little bit long, pin high, but we're putting for birdie. Greens aren't particularly soft. I've learned a lot there. Downhill, right to left. On your bike, sir. Hmm, typically weak start. Well, that's put pay to the three put percentages early. What a dreadful start from the young man. Can we start again? Damn it! 374 yard par four with some water short right of the green. Not really a concern for me here though. I'm just gonna smash driver somewhere up the left centre, hopefully. That was a nice ball flight. I wasn't expecting to draw it, so it's a tiny bit left of where I was aiming. But I think it's all right according to the map. Come on. I have 109 to the middle, so it's just a smooth 52. I'm going to aim right of it because the wind's quite strong right to left just smooth one in a little bit short is not the end of the world that needs to hook and it's long I've got a wrong yardage how very confusing I do not hit my 52 that far right well we'll just have to go get up and down Opportunity to get up and down here. It's downhill but slightly into the wind. Just get it on the green and rolling. Sit. Sit. Not bad. Not bad at all. Got a little tiddler for me par though. Good five or six feet here for me par save. Very positive and straight in the centre. That somewhat makes up for my bogey on one, if I could say so. That was an interesting hole, not sure how to describe it. And we move now back in the opposite direction to a 415 yard par four. So I'm forced really to hit driver. Quite a strong breeze left to right, so we're aiming up the left side, let it drift back. Bit of a bottom groover, but that'll do very nicely. I think I'm hitting a draw today, which is quite pleasant and very unexpected. Look, after a brief interlude of letting someone through who very much took his time, got 143 to the pin. So I've got a nine iron, trying to land it just short and just bounce it on. Lovely strike. Wind's not really touched it. 
I'm quite pleased with that. Pin high, just on the fringe, so unlikely to three put, which is a bonus. <laughs> Very nicely judged approach, and pin high, but just off the green. It's all sloping away from me, and left to right, and I'm being abused by a crow. Tiny bit tentative, but it has reached the hole. That's quite a tough hole on this course, I feel like, so I will take a four all day long. Thank you, goodbye. 175 yard par three, but the wind's helping off the right. We've got eight iron, that's about a 160 club, that should be plenty. Just draw it in on the wind. I shoved it a bit. Need a lot of help. I'm not sure. I think it got over that front right bunker. Hopefully be putting, but it'll be a long one. Tee shot was pretty good for distance, but not for line. Got a lot of work to do here, a bit of fringe to go over. Uphill, right to left. Need to nestle this one close if I can. Wow, I actually thought that was really good halfway and it's just taken off. Oh, that is a nasty one for par. Trust in the claw. Oh, that's another superb putt. Go me, that's delightful. What a save. Buoyed by that wonderful par save on the last. We now have a par five, but there is trouble lurking, right especially. I need to go pretty much over these trees. Wind's left to right. So let's just hit it over there. Try and hit it straight. Might get up in two. That's got to hold on desperately. It's so close. We're in. Didn't really deserve to be. I don't know how that stayed straight. But we're in play, lads and lasses. Huge. Right. 2.15 up to the flag. Not the best lie, but I'm lucky to be in play at all. So no complaints. Try and hack hybrid up to the green somewhere. That would be... Delightful, honestly. That's a weird knuckleball. It's straight at it. Might have to get down, actually. Yep, I've just seen it roll all the way off the back. Didn't think I'd be long. Pretty good, though. Right, well, I've run quite considerably over the back, which is a bit of a surprise, but never mind. Grass is growing towards me, which is good. Just need to flop this on, let it roll down. Wow, that's so firm. Went the opposite direction to what I thought when it was on the ground. But we have one of those putts for the bird. And I've made all of them so far today. Thank you. Straight in the middle. And we're back to level. That's huge. Feel good. Lovely up and down for birdie there. That's the first of the three we're looking for today. Now we have a 366 yard par four dog leg right to left, but the wind is down off the left. So that makes hitting a draw more difficult too afraid to hit driver over the corner so we've just got hybrid that was about as good as I can hit a hybrid absolutely enormous bounce looks pretty good to me I'm definitely in play let's go and make ourselves another birdie great tee shot in the end a bit difficult when you have no idea where you're going We've got 109 to flag downwind, so I'm just going to take a little bit off the 52 here. Sit. Spin. 
yeah a little bit long again huge bounce on the green which makes things hard but i'll take that putting for birdie about 25 feet long of pin high the way my putting's been who knows this for two in a row Well, that rolled end over end beautifully, which is a joy to watch. However, I just massively misread the putt. It was very, very straight. Definitely not upset with tapping pars, though. It's a really good start, this. Really pleased. Well, I'm playing nicely, but I need to concentrate. Got a very, very gettable par four here. It's 2.30 into the wind. So I'm just going to go straight at the pin with a three wood. No idea what's over there. That was like a healy pull. Very, very worrying indeed. Who knows, it could be my day. Found my ball, the tee shot was awful. But I've got an opportunity here. Just want to land it on the bank short. I could go high, but I risk hitting limbs. Well, that's pretty well genius. It came out so much lower than I thought, but it's worked out splendidly. Well, somewhat miraculously, we're putting for the birdie. Whether I deserve it or not, I want it in. Ow, my knee. That cracked. Did not deserve to go in, but I thought I had it for a while. Nevertheless, after thinking I'd lost my ball, a par is not a bad result at all. Tell you what, guys, enjoying the course very much. Definitely helps when you play half decently as well. Eighth hole, 150 yards, nice little par three. I've got nine iron stick it on the green and give ourselves another birdie try. We'll just hit a gorgeous draw into the wind. That was delicious, although I think I'm a bit long of the flag now, annoyingly. Definitely a bit of breeze to consider today. I've gone long again and I've got another 25 footer. One of these will drop at some point. Yes, the wind definitely stopped that getting there. Yep, lovely. Another solid par and still level. And if you're enjoying the content, don't forget to like the video. And if you're new, maybe subscribe if you are enjoying this sort of content. Thank you. Right, it is a par five, this ninth hole, but it's stroke index two for a reason. It's 530 yards. The river whisk all the way up the right side and OB left, so I'm playing it as a three-shotter. Sorry. That started right of where I was aiming, but thankfully it's coming sideways. Well, that's going to be an interesting second because I'm going to be going over some trees and river. But it's in play. Could be worse. Right, this is a tough hole. I'm literally three inches off the fairway and it's a very snaggy lie so I can only really hit seven over the corner of the trees try and give myself a shot in oh caught that a tiny bit thin but that'll be all right yep please that got on the fairway and there is some sort of fighter jet ahead of us cool Right, just on the left edge of the fairway, good layup. Still 136 to go. Wind off the right, so I have to flirt with this right flag. Just a nice wedge, I hope. What a strike. And it's holding its line. That is a nice golf shot, if I do say so myself. Swinging it nicely. 
pin high, maybe 12 feet. Last hole of the front line. Let's get my second birdie. Come on. Right then. I'm very pleased to have a birdie put uphill. Going straight. Hope you've enjoyed the front nine. I'll see you next week for the back nine once this goes in for birdie. Drat. Decent putt, tiny misread. See you next week. Goodbye.